I don't feel that bad at all. I don't know. Everyone has this confinement syndrome, you know? Feeling isolated, trapped, longing for the sun and all. Honey, I don't feel that way. And it seems like I'm the only one who doesn't. But my knowledge of the world is limited to these walls. Day zero wasn't the best time to be born. I don't want to sound cold, but we all have our own problems. Mine are different from those of the others. There's really nothing to complain about, except for, well, listening to the other people complaining all the time. I don't really need these sessions, but the colonel is very specific about regular examinations in the shelter. That's why... Hey, are you listening to me, Doc? Hmm? Sorry, I might have missed something. Can we finish tomorrow morning? Um, okay, I guess. I've not been sleeping well lately, and you're my eighth patient today. I understand. I guess you must have some reasons to be tired. Surprise, surprise. Door won't work, just like the therapy. Let me see. Damn it. Let's hope at least my PDA still works. Yes? Yes, Dr. Tokai here, but... You're a shrink, aren't you? Do you have a minute? Now's not a it's good... It's not that I didn't try. It took some time to make up my mind. But it sure felt great to do something about it at last. It felt just like a birthday. You're not saying anything. What's on your mind? I'm usually the one to ask this question. You sound tired, Doc. Go back to sleep. Who the hell was that? Sounded like a real nut job. Where did she... How? I'd like to tell him a thing or two. Hey to you, Doc. I didn't know that the third... Good morning, Shelter. Attention, tram number four, connecting the main entrance. I need a little pick-me-up. Shit. Hi, Albert. Kick it. That usually works. Well, not today, apparently. Looks like it's the bar for us. Come on. What's going on, man? No offense, but you look like shit. Rough night, huh? Well, I think my dream job's getting to me finally. Believe me, I know what you mean. I feel like this cog in the machine, you know? It makes sense when you look at it. Helps maintain order. Yet, people are depressed. 
I think the Colonel planned it all wrong. Energy. But you're energy the shrink. For you. you know all this. We're all that's left of humanity, and a bunch of malcontents at that. It doesn't bode well for the new civilization. Anyway, what's up? <laughs> Are you forcing small talk? Right. Nice weather we've been having lately, don't you think? Ha, <laughs> true. But that plutonium rain this morning ruined my barbecue plans. Man, I hate this place. Yeah, me too. If it weren't for Carolina... Um, yeah. How's the situation, anyway? He's not avoiding me like other people, so I can't really complain. Ah, uh, don't let it get to you. It's the price of being a shrink. You're collecting people's thoughts for the Colonel. No wonder they're avoiding you. But I'm glad you're together now. It takes the edge off a bit when you have someone by your side. Anyway, thanks for the advice about the vending machine. For a minute there, I felt genuinely relieved. Guess I should use that in my therapy. Stress relief through violence. <laughs> Sounds pretty catchy, don't you think? Attention! Albert Kokai is to be detained immediately for crimes against the Republic. What the fuck? Uh, I'll explain later. It's bullshit. Maybe so, Dr. Tokai, but it won't be Mr. Gokla you'll be explaining to. Please do not resist. How do you like that medicine? Are you sleeping, dog? Analyze this. That must have hurt you. Attention, everyone is to stay in their rooms or recreational areas until further notice. No, I haven't seen him. And I have no idea where he is. Why are you looking for him? What has he done? That is none of your business, madam. There he is! Get him! Oh, shit! Personnel are conducting a search for Toka. He may be armed and dangerous. He is to be detained immediately. Glad you made it, but the room isn't safe. I'm waiting in my workshop. Hurry, I'll open the door for you. Who did you piss off this time? The whole area is crawling with guards, all looking for you. Carolina, is she safe? As far as I know, yes. They've locked her in her room. But it's you they're after. You have to hide and wait this out. Go to the tech area behind my cubbyhole. I'll try to find out what the story is. 
Don't worry about her. They've turned the power off, but I've got my own generator. I didn't have time to change the fuse, though. You wouldn't mind doing me a favor, would you? But... Don't worry. I'll try to restore the main power supply. It may take some time, though. I hope you're not afraid of the dark. There's no monsters there. It's a complete mess in here. I have to watch my step. That's what I was looking for. Albert Tucker, 34 years old. Albert Tucker, 34. Psychiatrist. Albert Tokai, pharmacologist. Albert Tokai, born on the 13th of May, 1999. Albert Tokai. Sacrifices are to be made. Only then can a nation begin anew. And one of those to be sacrificed has just arrived. Welcome, Mr. Doka. Huh? Are you? Damn. Why do I even come here if you're not paying attention? Screw this. I'm sorry. I... Whatever. See you later, Dr. Dozy. We'll finish it tomorrow. Yeah, I know. I know. 